How horror films have changed since the 1980s. Warning, this may contain spoilers. Today, we will discuss how horror films have changed since the genre's peak in the 80s, how they affected the audience, what special effects they used, and what technology they used. 1980s Friday the 13th The first horror film that comes to mind when speaking about the 1980s is Friday the 13th, which is a slasher that premiered on the 9th of May in the year 1980 in the USA. The film made slasher horror popular and introduced Jason Voorhees, a recognisable antagonist to any fan of the scary genre. But he did not gain that kind of look until the third film in the series, where he wears a fibrous sports-style Detroit Red Wings goalkeeper hockey mask. The Shining The film features a famous line, Here's Johnny, which Jack Torrance says when he attempts to break down the bathroom door with an axe, and is one of the most famous scenes in the history of horror. Another notable scene is when the elevator gushes out a sea of blood and is seen as one of the most terrifying scenes in the genre. 1990s Scream The creator of Scream, Kevin Williamson, grew up watching other horror films and was inspired to write the plot of the film after watching the news of murders by the Gainesville Ripper. The film has also been parodied by Scary Movie, which is a popular film in horror comedy, with the antagonist also being Ghostface, and the opening scene and idea of the killer phoning his victims are inspired by 1996's Scream. 2010s It The film heavily differs from the previous incarnation of It, where, in 1990, Pennywise was an actor that wore a red wig and nose and white makeup. This was also a miniseries that aired on television, whereas the 2017 version of it brought the fear of clowns to the 21st century with CGI and practical special effects to make the film that bit scarier. These special effects came in with a ton of makeup to form Pennywise, which would seem very unsettling and unnatural to plenty of viewers. 2020s Coming into the current decade, I believe we are yet to see a notable horror film. However, older films like The Exorcist are getting another entry into their series, The Boogeyman, which is a film that will be based on the short story that was released in 1973 in Cavalier magazine, which has the same name. In conclusion, I believe that the horror genre has changed a lot in a lot of areas, from the technology used to make the productions a reality, to the effects and talents of the actors. The technology has gone from using basic physical prosthetics in the 1980s to using complicated software and hardware in computers to make production much easier, whereas using physical objects and whole sets would prove difficult to create the effects in films like Prometheus, and the actors have become more talented and struggle less in the production phase, from the cruel effects of Shelley Duval to the enjoyment that surrounded Bill Skarsgård while he played Pennywise in 2017's It. Brought to you by Mark Murphy Director.